hey hey guys this is Hawkeye and I am back with Ultimate Fishing Simulator and again as I had said with the previous game for Fishing Sim World it's been a while since I've been here but I am back and I will keep making videos of this game as often as I can but we're over here on the northern end of the map I haven't tried fishing over here just yet but it looks like there's a lot of activity lots of fish out there not even going to assume what kind but we're hoping that it's codfish or maybe some species that we haven't caught yet I'm going to take a camera view here let's slow this down a little bit first though Whoa, that, that is what I call not wasting any time. Looks like an Atlantic salmon to me. We shall see here in a minute. Damn, I didn't even have time to do anything. He was just like, give me that. Whoa. He's strong. Yeah, somebody told me that you can catch codfish when you go out deep sea fishing that are absolutely huge. But I don't have that kind of gear just yet. I already made a fool out of myself trying to catch the marlin. I'm not going to do that just yet. Let's get, let's get ourselves up a little bit. We're able to get some seriously big heavy line then we'll make that attempt but for now I mean we might go out and try just to see if there's anything we can catch but I wouldn't count on it <laughs> okay he is definitely giving up gonna be careful though these guys sometimes now that is a nice Atlantic salmon. Very, very nice. We'll sell him too. There's plenty of them out there, I'll tell you that. I was kind of surprised that he bit on that, to be honest, because I was trying to get the speed down. And I didn't let it sink all the way to the bottom usually you don't get a whole lot when that happens but he didn't care this seems to be a real good lure though for these guys they don't seem to hesitate if they're interested they're gonna bite so damn <laughs> love it now that's a codfish that is a codfish so he might be a little bit bigger got to be patient he'll turn around yeah we got him I knew the others were Atlantic salmon, but wasn't sure if the codfish were here or not. Okay, he's almost in, so let's go ahead and get our view out here. That's a big fish right just right out there. It's another cod. Whoa, okay, see what I... Oh, you gotta watch that. Those, they're sneaky. They are sneaky. If they pull that crap, quickly. Take your... There we go. Quickly, quickly, take your... Tension back down. There you go, guys. But the Greenland Cod's a little bit different than the Atlantic Cod. I don't think they're quite as big...
I mean, I could be wrong, you know, but... Let's take our tension back down, because... Could get ugly if we don't... See, there's fish right there. As soon as you get down there. And I've actually had them just snag it as soon as it's hits bottom. Damn. Now that's an Atlantic salmon. Okay. Get him to turn around here if we can. There's something different. I saw. I don't know what it was, but it was not a codfish. I don't know what it was. Yeah, you catch them pretty fast around here. That's one thing that's nice. You don't get bored. Sounds like our washing machine's acting up. He's not as big as the last one, but he's not bad. I'm just curious here, guys. Let's see if we can't... Hold on, guys. I've got some issues with my washing machine. <laughs> okay, I think it's been resolved. Let's go back to our lures here. Let's see. We've got spinners. This one's a 5 aught. That's a good size lure. Tell you what, why don't we upsize it to a seven? See if that changes our luck any. If nothing bites, then we'll just either go back to that or we'll try something else. Sometimes just increasing that hook size will be enough to attract a bigger fish. Sometimes not. So far I haven't gotten a note that tells me that the hook is too big to catch anything here. So that's a good sign. Ah, see? At least it tells you. <laughs> that way you're not wasting your time totally. So, I can't use one that size. Looks like 5 odd is about it. What we can do for right here. Let me see here. Is there something... Let's check out other lures here. We've got different lures here with different size hooks. That's the one we're using. This one goes up to six aught. And it's it's possible. Let's see, we don't have it though, do we? No, yeah we do. Let's try this one guys. This is a little bit bigger. Might be able to get a bigger fish. Might not. We will see. Doesn't hurt to try. We do know what works. 
A spoon, wider spoon with a five odd hook. I will say one thing, it definitely looks attractive. Does a lot of flashing. Mm. Yep. Whoa. Okay. Wasn't sure about that for a minute there, but then he uh, pretty much told me otherwise. This one's pretty good size, guys. This might be maxing out our gear here. But we're going to get him in, I swear to God. We're going to get this son of a gun in. And he is turning. He's turning. Well... He was starting to turn. Whew. Okay. This is a fight, guys. This is a fight. We got him, though. We just gotta really watch it because they love the bolt. This is a codfish. They like to wait until you they get right up close to you and then they bolt. Hit it with a whole bunch of pressure and snap the line. Yeah, this guy's this is this is a good fish. This I'd be nice if we break our record with this guy. I'm, as long as I'm getting him in with 43, in fact, I might even take it down to 29 just in case he decides to pull one of their sneaky tricks. Yep, see what he's doing? See what he's doing? He little pain in the butt. They are good at that. So you didn't fool me. You didn't fool me. You little... Damn you. <laughs> Sneaky little devil. Smart fish. Smart fish. He's like, I'm not going down without a fight. He's a big fish, guys. Oh, ho, ho, ho. new record, Atlantic Cod, 25.55 pounds. Yeah, I knew he was a good one. 174. Yep, the bigger hook paid off, guys. The bigger hook paid off, for sure. Watch that tension. Yeah, that looked like a lure something would want to go after. Now he hit it pretty close to shore, too. Now see, now it's saying there's no fish the right size, so we may have to look around a little bit. If that happens, guys, if you just hit your cue, you won't have to reel it all back in. Well, let's take a look around, see if we see any big fish. Yeah, see, most of these guys look kind of small. They might be bigger over here. Let's give it a try on this side.
It always says that no luring method. Kind of irritating. <laughs> it's like I'm letting it go to the bottom. What the hell's wrong with you? It says it's too big. And that very well could be. It could have been that that was just the biggest fish that was in the location. Alright. Let's see here. Let's go down a little bit further. Oh, I'm leaving fishery. So... Okay, let's take a look here. Well, there's plenty of fish out there. But I really want to get some bigger ones if I possibly can. So let's take a look around the map here a little bit. I see I was up here at one. Now two is a good spot as well. Just off the lighthouse, right over here. Let's take a look. See if there's anything massive out there. Ooh, there's a lot of fish over in this side. Check it out. Thing is, are they big? We don't know. We don't know if they're big. We shall see. We shall see. Now that's a fish I haven't seen. What is that? It's an interesting looking fish. Oh my goodness, what are those? It already says the hook's too big, so let's fix that situation. Let's see, we can actually size this down a little bit too. Let's try that. It's just, wait a minute, what types of fish go for that too? Halibut, cod. Hmm. I don't know what they are, but they seem like they feed off the bottom. Uh, I don't know. Maybe we should switch our rods here. Let's see, we've got live bait here on this one. But I don't think what we're after is going to go for that. Let's check the cut bait. Maybe it. Maybe that's what they call a lump fish or something. I don't know. I don't know what a Atlantic wolf fish is. Capelin? Well, they look like they feed off the bottom. Let's just try it. Put a cup, well, we can only put one on there. We'll give it a shot. put my rod pod down because I've got to find out what these are. I am really curious. That's not what I wanted to do.
Rock pod can't be set up here. Why not? Oh, okay. There it can be. We'll see. Hopefully the hooks are right size. <laughs> but we're going to try this out here as well. So what have I got hook size here? Three aught? That's probably good. Let's put the corn on there. We're going to make the length of the line there pretty good size. Are getting a bite. We are getting a bite. That was just pure experimentation there, guys. I didn't know what we were going to do, or if anything. But, with bottom fishing, this is always like a big surprise, because there's no camera on this. not huge but definitely we've got a something we've not seen before there's a little red fish out there too I don't know what kind he is but I think that's one of those fish I saw yeah, it is. Okay, so this is an Atlantic wolf fish. That is an odd looking fish. <laughs> That's a face only a mother could love. <laughs> it's got a pretty blue color though. I will say that for him. Let me get a picture of him. He's kind of he's cool. He's cool. Now what hook size do I have on here? Let's see. One aught. Alright, so I got him with a one aught. Let's try two aught. Maybe we can get a bigger one. This one. Okay, that's a two odd as well. And if they look like they had pretty big mouths, so I think we're gonna be good. Let's see here. It looks like there's plenty of them out there. for the float rods or not, but we'll give it a try. Looks like we got one elsewhere. Yep, this one now. A 
Well, at least we know they are going to go for two odd hooks. That was a little bit leery that I was going to end up missing a fish because I put two odd hooks on everything. But sometimes you got to test them out just to see if you can catch a bigger fish. So I'm going to... Yeah, he's not a monster though either. I think it's another wolf fish. Yep, yeah, it is. Nice. They are so funky looking. <laughs> Let's see, where are these guys? See if there's any of them that are bigger out this way. I can see them. Now that, now that I know their body shape. I can now know what to look for. See if we can't get one more. And there's one down there at the bottom. See him? He's just moseying along. I don't know that he's going to go for this since it's way up here. But not looking interested. Doesn't matter. Yeah, I think this is probably going to be all we're going to be able to get in this episode, but I am very pleased with the way this turned out. I like to try to catch as many of the species as I can, because I just want to have a nice, diverse catch. Plus, you get more trophies to put up in your, you know, the trophy room. See if we can't get this guy in a little quicker. Yep, that's another wolf fish. See how big this dude is. New record. 5.38 pounds. Such a weird looking fish. <laughs> Such a weird looking fish. Alright, we're going to sell him to... Alright guys, we got to see some new species. Caught quite a few just in a short period of time. Not bad, I tell you. Not bad at all. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Please be sure to share, comment, like, and subscribe. And I will be back with another episode of Ultimate Fishing Simulator. So until then, guys, as always, same straight cast far and have fun. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.